What's up guys, it's Ben, AKA RC New, back outside here learning as I go. Just to give you a little sneak peek, I'm gonna be, uh, I'm doing a little upgrade project on the uh, Rustler here. So it's mostly already done, but uh, just to uh, make her look a little prettier, I have, let's see, put these A-arms on here and Let's see, I'll get a better look at these later, but I have these uh, aluminum Traxxas parts in here. I um, have this new body I have not driven on yet. So I'm trying to keep that pretty as well. Um, but today I am going to pick up some Duratrax wheels and tires. I have these Proline wheels and tires for the off-road but i actually wanted to get some accidentally bought these ones and they are a little too big the hex mounts actually don't even fit so i want basically the identical wheels and tires but i want them to fit and i don't even necessarily care about if they're functional or not as far as road tires i just want it to look pretty with my new body and my upgrades. So there's that. Um, also, let's see, I have to replace an axle or a drive shaft. I believe that's the same thing. Let's see, I broke that last time. I'm doing jumps and stuff off the ramp. So let's see. Oh, and also on a mission to improve the audio and video quality I have this media mod for the GoPro and so I will be using that from now on most likely and I am going to pick up a camera or not a camera a microphone with to uh, help eliminate some of the wind because if there's one thing I can't stand it's watching videos with wind in it so anyway that's what I got going on for now, so wish me luck. We'll see how this goes. Jackpot. Now to find a place to put in some work. All right, a little bit of bad news. Um, my order apparently was still pending for my microphone, so the audio might still be a little windy out here. Easy peasy even for a guy like me. Now, as we see, I did do some of the, uh, I got the RPM A-arms, I believe they're called, and some of the, uh, I got some bearing replacements. I did the uh, steering blocks in the front. Slap these tires back on just for a moment so you can see how they run. These are the Proline Trenchers. They are not belted. I actually wanted the belted ones, but Nobody had them in stock at the time, so I went with these. They are impossible to keep the front end on the ground, even at higher speeds, you can still pull a wheelie. So I'll run this around a little bit, and hopefully we don't get thrown out of here. And then I will swap these tires out for the Duratrax tires and see how they perform. All right, wish me luck.
cartwheel there. Okay, good enough for me. Let's swap these out. Let's hope these fit or I will probably delete this video and skip the whole thing. All right. So far, so good. Proline is the popular name and aftermarket parts, but I actually just like the way these tires look better. So hopefully it looks cool. Hopefully it looks uh, the way I picture it. So far, so good. I really like this actually so far. All right, all right, all right. Here we go. All right, there we go. I'm not sure how I feel about the green parts anymore. I actually started with uh, doing the green and blue mix with the old body before I even knew this body existed. So, I don't know, let me know what you think. All right, the real moment of truth. I think I say moment of truth a lot, but now as I say I didn't I didn't put these wheels and tires on for performance. I did it more for looks. I think I do like the way it looks. But um I do want to have a go at them of course to see how they perform as street tires. I'm used to the wrestler doing standing back flips. Grinding out the Years with the rear differential, I believe I destroyed doing rear backflips. As a reminder, I don't know a lot of the technical terms, so I get a lot of stuff wrong. But I'm learning, and thanks for coming along with me as I learn. <laughs> Man, it performs really well. I'm almost surprised. Turned into a little street rustler here. Still fully capable of pulling a wheelie, but it doesn't flip over. Roll on the curves, it actually handles, actually corners pretty well for a rustler. Surprised, I like it. And I like the green accents too. I wasn't sure at first, sometimes it takes a little getting used to, and this didn't take much getting used to at all. <laughs> I like it. What do you guys think? Did I do good with my first makeover project? My first, uh, yeah, you call it a makeover? Even handles a little speed bump really well. Catches a little bit of air. Oh! I don't want to scratch that. No scratches. No scratches. Yeah, there we go. Spun around, didn't flip. Oh, here comes some cars. It's getting too busy out here this time of day, I think. Probably not gonna be hopping up any curbs anymore with these smaller tires, but.
if he wants to race it. Camaro don't want none. Again, I apologize for the wind. Hopefully this will be the last windy video I have to make. Still pulls a wheelie when still fully capable of popping a wheelie. All right, guys, I think that's gonna do it. Thanks for watching. Stay positive. Get outside while you still can before the snow comes. Oh no, I'm scratching my new blue body. Okay, <laughs> that's a good way to end it. Take care.